Welcome to North Carolina Weekend. I'm Deborah Holt Noel. Summer is a great time to visit one of North Carolina's great winter destinations, Beach Mountain. The lifts are still in service for those who love to go downhill fast, but we're not talking about skiers. And getting around by all-terrain vehicle is just as much fun in August as it is a necessity in January. Here's Rick Sullivan with a long list of things to do when you get there. Welcome to an area at the top of Beach Mountain called the Emerald Outback. It's not easy to reach, but for some, this is what makes it fun. A lot of people come up here and they want to know where's the top of the mountain? How do we get there? This is this is how you get there. You can either ride the ski lift, you can get any and Beach Mountain Adventure Tours to take you up here, or if you can find your way up, you can drive your car up here. I consider this a, a hidden gem up here. The Emerald Outback was built by the town of Beach Mountain. Here, you can find more than eight miles of hiking and biking trails, no fees involved. But you'll use plenty of energy getting there, or you can use Beach Mountain Adventure Tours. Most of the tours are about an hour, hour and 10 minutes, 15 minutes long, depending on how many photo ops we stop to do. The utility vehicle ride itself can rival the view you get at the top. Hiking from the North Pinnacle Ridge parking lot is also an option, one that Jim Brooks chooses regularly. That's because on a day like this, when it's pushing 100 degrees in Raleigh and Charlotte, the top of Beach Mountain is a breath of fresh air. Oh, well, you're seeing, you know, the expected high today, 77, and I was watching various TV weather people this morning, and they were saying that if you want to escape the heat, you could go to the mountains because it wasn't going to get above 86. And I'm going, gosh, if they only knew about my town, 77. In fact, Beach Mountains Club has a golf package called the Summer of 79. Book an overnight and a tea time, and if the temperature gets higher than 79 degrees, you'll get another round of golf on the house. The club also has an impressive tennis complex that overnighters can access. And nearby, more public hiking trails that require far less effort than the Emerald Outback. But some folks prefer the effort, lots of it. Years ago, a certain pro cyclist won a couple of races climbing the Beach Mountain Parkway. I chose a Category 1 climb called Pinnacle Ridge Road, a nearly four-mile climb up to the outback with an 8% grade. But it was this stretch of more than 20% that brought me to a halt. At over 5,500 feet, Beach Mountain is the highest incorporated town east of the Rocky Mountains. That makes downhill mountain bike riding the signature activity in summer. Warning though, do not approach downhill riding with a cross-country mentality. Yeah, that, that will normally result in some you know, broken wheels or a crash that breaks something on the bike and then those people come in and rent a little heavier duty bike from us and go back out and have a good time. But if you rent or bring the right equipment and attitude, you just might enjoy downhill riding. A uniquely Beach Mountain experience. Unique because this is the only place in North Carolina you can get your bike to the top via chairlift. Once you're dropped off at nearly a mile high, the ride down can be as thrilling or safe as you want to make it. The trails originally were built pretty much straight down the mountain and uh, were designed to be difficult to ride and we're now altering some segments of some of the existing trails to make them traverse the slopes more extensively and then in turn it slows the riders down um, so you're not on your brakes the whole way and we've built up dirt berms and rollers to also help uh, provide a better experience for the new riders. From daring descents to easy peasy activities with family and friends Dare we say that Beach Mountain in summer rivals the beach on the other side of the state? Well, we're definitely a year-round destination, or we're starting to evolve into that. Um, we also have an 18-hole disc golf course. We do yoga on Saturday mornings, live music. We have two restaurants and a brewery. A fabulous way to wind down from a big day of Beach Mountain summer madness. I'm Rick Sullivan for North Carolina Weekend. For more information about all things Beach Mountain, go to the town's website at beach.com.
mtn.com or call the Beach Mountain Visitor Center at 800-468-5506.